Alabama couple Nancy Dobson and Margaret Wilborn are very happy their marriage is recognized in all 50 states. It's, just cool. it's a good thing to be able to travel and go state to state and be recognized as a legal married couple. Our biggest thing probably at our age is the fact that if we have to go to a hospital now, we don't have to show a power of attorney slip to check on each other. Dobson and Wilborn got married right after the U.S. District Court issued a ruling allowing same-sex marriage in Alabama. Soon after, that ruling was overturned by Alabama Supreme Court Judge Roy Moore. According to Pastor Emily Bell, a minister at Forgiving Heart Christian Community Church, all these different rulings were confusing. Did a few uh, weddings in that, that short little period of time when it was uh, uh, they were issuing the licenses. And after that, Judge Roy Moore made, said what he said about you know, not issuing anymore. They were calling me and wouldn't know what to do. I said, well, just hang tight. Hang tight, wait for June. And patiently wait they did. Last week, five of the nine Supreme Court justices said same-sex marriage is legal, but despite their decision, some states are resisting, including Alabama, where some people don't believe in gay marriage. Well, I believe God made Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve, baby. I believe marriage should be between man and woman. Newlywed, Trustee Lane says, this ruling changes what marriage means. If same-sex people want to live together, good. Give them the rights and give them all the benefits, but don't call it marriage. Call it a union. Call it something. So now probate judges have the option not to issue marriage licenses for the next 25 days as the Alabama courts challenge the U.S. Supreme Court's decision. For WLTZ First News, I'm Paris Holmes.